Welcome beautiful people of YouTube, Guy Gash here again today bringing you another video. Today we're going to be talking about how to become an alchemist. So what is an alchemist? Uh, an alchemist was back in ancient times, I think they originated from Greece in the Greek times. And um, yeah, basically it's early chemistry, concert, sorry about that, my back were a bit stiff then. Um, converting base metals into gold. So how does this apply in this video today? What I'm talking about is basically how to change your circumstances from being a negative into a positive. So the first step to becoming an alchemist is don't deny yourself of your thoughts and emotions. Don't deny yourself of these things. So what we have, tend to do is, is if we have negative thoughts, if we have negative emotions, if we feel anger, if we feel stress, yes, we can act them out and sometimes that can be considered bad, but we deny ourselves, we shut them off, we say, no, these are these are bad emotions, these are I shouldn't be thinking them things, I shouldn't be feeling them things, I shouldn't be feeling this way. So the first step, accept accept your thoughts and emotions accept them for what they are till you accept exactly what's going on in your mind in your emotions how you're feeling till you accept that you won't be able to do anything with it you won't be able to change it you won't be able to transmute it or transform it so the second step once you've accepted your thoughts and emotions now you've got to look at it objectively let your emotions play out we find ourselves if we repeatedly say something that's upset us or, you know, we go back over a topic that's happened, we'll say, oh, you know, we're reliving it, we're regurgitating it, we're trying to keep it going. That's not always the case. Sometimes you need a bit of time to process a situation. You need a bit of time to process it and let it go. So the second step, once you've accepted it, is trying to let that go. Trying to let them thoughts and emotions and feelings, let them go. Let them uh, look at them objectively and try and release them or release your attachment to them, at least your grip onto them. So moving forward in, onto my third step, onto different situations and as situations arise. Basically, if you're having your environment or situations are occurring or your life's panning out in the way you don't want it to and you're thinking this is rubbish this is bad and all you can see in a situation or your life or yourself for that matter is bad bad negative energy then you're choosing to look at the bad and the negative that's what you're choosing to focus on and we have the power to choose what we end of the day what is good and bad it's our perception of what's going on, the perception of our reality that is the good and bad, what we perceive as good and bad. So if you choose, if your perception is the direct, direct source of what we see as good and bad, then that's in your power. And I'm not asking you to change your perception in, in a sense, but I'm asking you, you have the power to choose what you, what you allow in. So my life's been crazy over the past week i've had so much going on i've moved into my partners uh with her parents moving that's moving stuff around going through old stuff getting rid of old stuff we're saving up for a house you know a lot of high energy stuff's going on comes to last sunday my van breaks down and i've still got work to do Yes, this situation is bad, but I'm a choosing to dwell in it. I'm a cho don't get me wrong, that over the past few days, I have been stressed and I took myself on a walk and I realised, look, I'm overreacting to this situation on the grand scheme of my whole life, of all the years I've got left on this planet and forevermore. This is my new, this is, you know, people will be dreaming of this. Some people have got nothing and they'll be dreaming of my situation and that's me overcoming it. So overcoming stuff, then choosing to pick the best points out of the situation. I guarantee now if you're experiencing difficulty, you could sit yourself down in a quiet space and just think, right, I'm going to try and pick out the best points of what's going on in this situation, I, what I've learned from the situation, how I've gone stronger, learned more about myself, or even for me, like I'm not at work, but I get time to make videos. I get time to go out walking where I normally wouldn't. I'd be working eight till five or whatever and I wouldn't be able to go out walking. 
I get to spend time with Tilly, the little dog that we've got here, Hector. I've got other things that I can do that create positive emotions within me. I can look at them things and think, yeah, I'm actually happy about this situation. Although it's not panned out how I want it to be, there's still good in the situation. There's still good around me. There's still good things happening. And this is what I'm asking you to do. Become an alchemist of your own life. Life is meant to be enjoy uh, enjoyed. Treasury. And, well, I remember, um, coming on to my last point, I can't remember what number I am. I know you guys don't care. I just try and structure it that way, but uh, I think it's point number three or four, but we've covered a few points. Um, you know, treasure life every day. Appreciate life every day. If you're waking up and you're feeling that life's just a toll, you know, it's just... One of them things, we're just getting up and doing this thing. Seek more enjoyment. Try and treasure it. And, and, and for me, on a very practical level, I will just sit, I'll maybe do my meditation or before my meditation, and I'll just say, I'm not religious. I'm not religious of any kind. I'm not, I'm not a believer in many things. I just kind of feel for what I believe in. And I can sit there and I'll just say, you know what, and this is speaking to, into my own existence, you could call this a prayer, you could call this whatever you want. I treasure this life, I love this life, I, uh, I am appreciative. And just do, the, do different things wherever you are today. Wherever you are today, wherever you are, right in this moment, sat watching this video, I want you to just say to yourself, amongst all the mind chatter that's going on and the rattling of the brain, just say to yourself, today, I treasure this life. Today I appreciate this life. Today I love this life. Make this at the forefront because I find that people get dragged down and get pulled into the weight of what's going on in the surroundings when really it's light, it's fun. We can make this enjoyable. There's many stressful things been going on from a personal level in my life. Lots of big changes and big things going on. But we can pull through all these things that are happening to us the whole time are preparing us for what we are destined for, our, our, our last goal, where we're moving towards. This is what the preparation is. It's all a test. And when you come through all these situations and all these things that will never stop, because you will always grow, but you, they will never stop and you'll carry on evolving. The person you come out at the end of this, you will not even recognize who you was I don't even recognise who I was a month ago because I've changed so much, because I've grown so much and I've learnt so much. So keep moving forwards, keep going with yourself, be proud of who you are, accept who you are, accept your situation and choose to look at the positive things. Become an alchemist. Anything can happen to you, but there's always good in the bad and bad in the good. But you choose what you pick to look at. If you're always feeling like your life's bad and everything's negative, Choose to look at the good. It's your choice. The power is in your hands. As I always say on this channel, peace and love to anybody watching this. Take it easy. Become an alchemist. I want everybody who's watching this video to at least feel that they can make themselves a little bit happier today just by telling themselves, I am happy. I appreciate things. Woohoo! Let's do this together, man. Take it easy.